Field life is pretty much the ideal scenario for the best training you can get. Um, it definitely makes days go by long. There's not a really good way to get all the rocks up from underneath you. They're kind of everywhere. You can't really avoid them. Um, it cools down a little bit at night, but it's hot daily. It sucks about living out here in the field. Um, the worst part is easily the heat. There's no way to escape it. It seems like everything you do kind of drags until you finally get to the end of the day and you get to sit down and everyone's kind of laughing about how much it sucked, but if you enjoy it, it's well worth it for it. And they're like, can you give us some water? The benefits of field life for the Marines is that when you put everybody in an austere environment, it forms bonds between the guys. And our unit cohesion depends on their brotherhood, their bond. It's well worth it when you get to get back and finally sleep on a bed. It's something that no one else would understand when I spent through it. Sleeping out in the field is, you know, as close as you can get is the best training to simulate what we're going to be going through. Worst part about it is probably the lack of being able to change your camis. Going back to the normal life is, it's a lot easier than transitioning into being in the field, but um, it definitely feels nice to get back into it. Our reserve unit's from Fort Devens, Massachusetts, right outside of Boston, so coming out here is a little bit of a shift. You know, we're not exactly used to 105 degree heat with the sun beating down on you every day. But it's nice to see that all the guys can get acclimated to it and get the job done on it.